what is up you guys and welcome back to It's Magical Panicorn. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys the fastest way to complete the Sunshine Pass in Adopt Me. So you guys, before we get started, make sure to hit the subscribe button, leave a like on today's video, and turn on notification bell so you won't miss out on any awesome videos. Alright you guys, so let's go ahead and get started. So the Sunshine Pass just came out a couple of days ago, and this is a brand new pass that you guys want to can level up and get a bunch of amazing pets and rewards. So today, I'm going to be showing you guys the best way and tips and tricks on how to complete it super quickly. Okay guys, so the first thing I want to talk about is that you do have about two weeks to complete this event. And basically what you can do is if you guys want to like do a little bit every day, like there's only 40 tiers. So if you guys just want to do a couple every day, then you guys can do that. But I know some people also want to complete it like really quickly. So if you guys want to pace yourself and do it 14 days and use up your entire time, then you have to complete. Okay guys, so the first thing I want to talk about is the amount of time you have to complete the pass. So right now there's 14 days left, so you guys had a little bit over two weeks. And basically if you guys like want to only complete this on one account and only do it on your main account, then you guys can just get to all 40 tiers. You guys will have to do about three per day. And that's if you want to like only get one and just kind of, you know, do it on one account, get all the pets from here. And then you'd basically be done. So if you guys want to do that, you guys can do three tiers per day, which isn't too bad, honestly. And especially in the beginning, it's like super fast. So if you guys want to do more in the beginning, that's totally fine. But in the end, it does take a long time. Just like the Pony Pass, we see the same concept. But yeah, if you guys want to do that, you guys can. But today, I'm going to show you guys a little bit of a faster way to do it. If you guys like kind of want to complete it quickly, like I do, especially since I've gone on vacation. And I'll probably have less time as the weeks go on. So basically, what I want, what I would recommend doing is having some of your other accounts play as well. Especially if you guys want to have more than one. So currently, I have two other alt accounts in this game. So let me go and show you guys. So you guys can invite three, uh, up to two more people to play in a total of three people. So you guys can see right here. Here's my party. And you guys can invite your friends to play. Or if you don't have any, or if you just kind of like want to play by yourself, then you guys can invite your other accounts just to play as well. Unlike the Pony Pass, your other accounts do have to play. So they can't just like stand there and do nothing. They actually have to play the game or they won't get any points. So it does take three times the amount of time. But at the same time, you do get three times the amount of rewards. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys that. So here are my two other alt accounts. So I'm just going to go ahead and invite them right here. And then I'm going to accept it. And then we can go ahead and try it out. And I'm basically going to show you what I do. You guys don't have to do this. You guys can just do it on one account if you want to. It really depends on how many of the pets you want. Okay, guys. So I'm going to go and use one token. And a good thing is it only uses one token. So my other two accounts don't have to pay. So, you know, that's pretty good because they can play it a lot more times. So basically, I let my other two alt accounts just kind of stand there, do nothing. And then I go ahead and complete all of these on my main account first. And then I go on to the other side of my computer and do this account. And then I have one on my phone, which is going to be the hardest because it's on mobile. And it's really hard to play on that one. So that one, I usually get the least amount of points. But you know what? It's still better than nothing. So I'm going to go and do my main account first and go ahead and play all three games. Um, it takes a while because you have to play all three and that's kind of annoying. But, you know, it's all right. You know, it is fun, but it does get kind of like repetitive, you know, the same thing over and over. Um, this one is like average just game to rock through. I sometimes don't get perfect on all of them, but, you know, I tried to. Oops, I missed. Okay, well, that's all right. The maximum amount of points you can get is 300 if you get 100 on everything. I already know I'm not going to get 100 because I didn't get perfect on all of them. But that's all right, you know. It is pretty hard to get 300. Um, it is possible with some practice. So maybe one day I'll be able to get that many I think the closest I got was like 280, which is not too bad. All right, I missed again. Uh, there we go. Okay, I think I did pretty good that time. Probably got like 40 something. Let's see, 47. All right, not bad. So for this one, I got 90 points, which I think is pretty good. And then next is the trampoline. And the rock one, I didn't have too many tips because that one is kind of just you have to land the green. For the trampoline, I would recommend not being in first person. Like, don't do this because then it's really hard to see. Like, just kind of be out and just look at your shadow. You guys can see my shadow on my body. And oops, I missed. Okay, well, make sure you hit the red, you guys. Don't hit the yellow because then you will only get five. You don't have to be exactly in the center. But as long as you hit the red and don't touch the yellow, then you guys will get ten points. Um, I know I lost some points at first because I was talking and didn't pay attention. But there we go. So you guys can basically, like, gauge off your shadow because that's a pretty good way to do it. Um, on mobile, I feel like it is a lot harder, but not bad. You know, I got 95 and then the tennis one, this one I would kind of recommend just kind of standing, like, in the middle because you don't know which way the ball is going to go. So right here... And also make sure both of your feet are in the red circle. Like, sometimes I'm, like, half in the circle with my feet, and then you only get five points. You have to be completely in the circle to get ten points, which sometimes can be hard, especially if the ball comes fast. But right now, we're doing pretty good. All right, so make sure you get nothing sticking out, you know? Because if it is, then you guys won't get ten points each time. 
And then, let's see, alright, so he's going over here. You guys can kind of gauge where the octopus is going a little bit. Not really, because it's kind of hard to tell. But yeah, just kind of go back, I go back to the middle every time after I hit it, so that I kind of, like, have a chance of getting it, like, on each side. You know, it's even for both sides. Okay, there we go, and that's it. Alright, so that one, I think we got 100 points. Right? Yeah, I got 100 points on that one. I think this is my first time getting 100 on that one. So that was not bad, you guys. That was pretty good. And I got a total of 285. Alright, not bad. That might have been my best score. Okay, guys, so basically once I'm done, I'm out of the minigame area, right? So I just go on to this account right here, which is one of my alt accounts. And then what I do is I'm just going to do the exact same thing. So I'm just going to speed this up because you guys probably don't want to watch me do this again. But this is basically what I do. Um, the same thing, you know, I just kind of did a rock, and then I do on my phone lastly. So it does take a long time. It wastes a lot of time. But you do get quite a bit of points. So, I mean, oops, I missed. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so. But it is pretty worth it if you guys want to get a bunch of the pets. Why am I missing so bad? Okay, I, that was really bad. I think that was the worst I've ever done. 23, that's so bad. Okay, well, let me go ahead. I'm going to focus this time. We're going to do better. And then, yeah, I'm going to speed this up so you guys don't have to watch the whole thing. <laughs> So you probably saw I didn't do two gun that round. I only got 209. And actually on the tennis, I like got stuck. Like I wouldn't move and I was like really laggy. So yeah, that computer is a little bit more laggy than mine right here that I'm filming on. So you know, it's kind of a little bit harder if you're lagging, especially for like the trampoline one as well, because you're kind of like floating and then you kind of land really quickly. So hopefully your device doesn't lag too much because it does. If it does, then it's going to be a lot harder. But yeah, so now I'm going to finish up my last account. I think I'll do the best on my main account because that one only got 209, I'm pretty sure. And on this one, I got 285. So that's pretty good. Usually I get around like 280, 285 on this one and those I don't do as well But now I'm gonna finish up my last account and I'm not gonna film it But I'm gonna show you guys what I get Okay guys, so I finished on my Panacore and XBFF account And that one actually did a lot better than I thought it would I got 260, so that's actually pretty good I messed up a little bit on the trampoline because it's really hard like on my phone But other than that, I feel like I did pretty good On the tennis one, I did pretty good and I didn't lag too much So that's pretty good And that one, let's see, um, what path, what level am I on? I'm on level, almost level 4 Five. I'm like 50 away from level 5, you guys. So not bad. Basically, I'm at the same point as my alt accounts. I mean, I'm a little bit ahead, but not like a lot. So if you guys do want to do this on like three accounts, you guys can. And then you guys, if you finish it, you will end up getting a lot of these pets and then a lot of these cheetahs. You'll get three of these cheetahs, which that's basically what I'm hoping for. Really, I'm just doing it for the legendary pet. I don't really care about the other ones as long as I have like one of them. But yeah, I mean, I really want to finish this pass because I feel like it'll be really fun to do. And it will be a lot really grindy, but you know, I do get some really good rewards like Asia Potions. Those are really helpful for legendary pets. And then like some, what are, I keep forgetting this name of this pet. Okay, I keep forgetting that name. And then the cheetah I really do want. So that is the legendary pet. So basically that's all my tips, you guys. My tips basically are to just grind a lot. Even though that's like kind of annoying because you know, it's basically like the same thing over and over. And also make sure to claim your tokens too. Every 40 minutes, you guys will get a token for free. And you do get a free token every day, like every real life day. You get a free token just for playing the game and logging in. So make sure you guys also log in every day as well just to get a free token. Alright guys, so just a little bit of a recap on today's tip. My first one was to make sure that you know like how many of each pets that you want. Basically how many times you want to complete the pass. And it's basically your choice if you guys just want to do your own account. That'll be a lot easier and you'll also complete it a lot faster because you don't have to like do everything three times. But yeah, overall, you know, it's pretty fun event. I like the concept of like the pass and I really enjoyed like the pony pass as well. So basically like the same thing. My second tip was just kind of some tips in a mini game, you know, like for the trampoline to just kind of look at your shadow and where you're going. Um, the rock one, I don't really have any tips except just to try to land it i mean it's basically just a timing thing once you get the timing down it's pretty simple and then the tennis just to make sure both of your feet are exactly in the red circle or if it's like sticking out then you guys will get like only five points i mean so it's kind of hard if you're lagging but you know for the most part it does work out pretty well 
All right, guys, and my last one is just to have fun with this, have fun playing the game and grinding, and then you guys will be rewarded with some really cool pets and items. All right, you guys, so that is going to be the end of today's video. If you guys did enjoy, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, turn on those post notifications. Also, don't forget to follow me on Roblox to join my games. Thank you guys all so much for watching, and I'll see you guys all next time. Bye!